Welcome back, my computer duders. You know what it is. I ain't got to set this shit up for you. It's time to pew pew and chew bubblegum. But we live in the distant future where bubblegum has been outlawed. So the only possible course of action is to pew pew. Pew 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 I have no mouth and I must be boo. I wonder how demanding this game is. Cause remember, I turned, I tried to turn the resolution up, and surprisingly, I couldn't turn up, uh, it up very far before the frame rate started to suffer. Which you wouldn't expect, given how sparsely detailed everything is. Razor auto cannon, razor firebolt. Is that powerful? I already have this. Uh, the, some of these are good. I don't want this, though. I don't want grenades, period. I, however, do want the... Cruel Shredder equipped. That thing is my standby. This thing sucks. This thing really sucks. Razor auto cannon. That looks like any other auto cannon. I'm gonna go back to uh, uh, rapid laser. Yeah, that was a good combo. I'm not gonna deviate too far from that. Some kind of rapid fire long range weapon and a shotgun. In fact, maybe just the shotgun. It's like Quake, where you don't even start with a pistol, you start with a shotgun, because that's all you need. A shotgun is an all-purpose tool that solves all your life's problems, even when those problems are people. I need to take care of him right away. Uh, nope, nope, nope. Where are you at? Shit! Would you not? Could you, could you not? Would you, could you in a house? Would you, could you with a mouse? Really with a mouse? You're sick, you have a problem. I mean in a house, that's... You can't very well do it on the street. This is, we live in a civilized society, but with a mouse? It won't even fit. You'll have to duct tape it around the middle so it doesn't explode. I, I mean, so, or so I heard from a friend. This is making me want remakes of classic polygonal games like Star Fox. Can you imagine a... a Remake of Star Fox at 90 FPS in this style, but it's the original SNES game. That's right, I say SNES. I apologize for nothing. Well, not for nothing. Oh, that's the shit I didn't want. Is there a better alternative to that? Let me try... Maybe that would be better. Maybe that, I can't tell. That just seems like a slower version of the same thing. I'll give it a shot. Give it a whirl. Probably the least sexy thing to hear. Baby, have you, have you found my cheese spot? Gee golly whiz, I'm about to give it a whirl. Fuckaroo. That's the best titty fart farting orgasm I ever had. Uh, 
What am I doing wrong? Hang on. I've not been here yet. Everything looks like everything else. Blue key, okay. Probably this is an ambush. I'm okay with that, though. It does seem much stronger. In exchange for a very delayed impact. And you have the fact that you have to lead your shots somewhat. Wow, no health packs for like the first half of the level and then suddenly all the fucking health packs I could ever ask for. So have you noticed the glut of VR chat videos? Recently it's like the new hot thing. Fellow kids, it's the new hip craze that's sweeping the nation like pogs. Pogs are still cool, right? But yeah, no, James Key's doing it, OMG Games is doing it, True Noom is doing it. Everybody's discovered that uh, VR chat is a cornucopia of collaborative improv comedy. I should get in on that. I, I'll, I just kind of do my own thing. I think people would probably rather watch me play VR chat, but then I have to talk to people. A large part of why I got VR in the first place is so I would never have to talk to people again. Understand. Understand, understand the concept, the concept of love. Oh, cool. The whatever that uh, this missile is called shoots two at once. I see no other advantages. Oh, it's rapid fire. I'm stupid, it turns out. That happens pretty frequently. It's the explanation for a lot of the questions that I have about my life. I guess I'll probably do VR chat inevitably. I just want to play some of this before I get to that. Probably by the time I do it, the heyday will be over and all the big celebrities won't be there anymore. I won't have to have a paranoid fears of, sh of making an ass of myself on one of their videos in front of millions of people. Let's see. You know what else this reminds me of? My mom! But no, really. Um, what was that game? Red Alarm. For Virtual Boy. The one that was all wireframe. But it was like a wireframe... Uh, Sort of Star Fox, but you had total freedom of movement technically, even though the, lo the levels were pretty much just corridors. So they were very linear, but you could turn around and fly backwards if you wanted to. You had total control over your ship. And all the bosses were like all range mode from Star Fox 64. You could fly anywhere you wanted. It worked pretty well. If you turned up the depth perception all the way, the fact that the walls were not textured was not a meaningful impediment to going where you wanted to and doing what you meant to do. Uh oh. Good thing I have missile regen. In theory. It's just a theory. Evolution's just a theory, guys. I don't understand why everybody laughs at me. They must simply be assholes. It's not possible that, in fact, they all understand something that I am incapable of understanding because then I wouldn't like that. That would give me bad ouchy no-no feelings in my tum-tum. Therefore, everyone else is wrong. And the Nigerian prince who emailed me really is going to send me $3 million too. They'll see. Won't they be sorry? Let's see. Anything good? crude pul why would I want a crude pulsar I'm not a crude rude dude who likes to eat food in the nude that would be lewd uh, rat okay w which one's out of ammo okay that one is out of ammo I guess I guess this one it's out of energy This is the combo I said would be retarded to use. Oh shit, I can't use, even use this one. 
Ah, fuck! There's no, f there's no ammo for this either. What, what's this little guy? This guy, this guy's giving me the most trouble, by far. Fuck! I have no ammo for anything. I gotta switch to my bullet weapons. I'm out of bullets too. What do I have? I have nothing. I have nothing. I have to get out of here. I gotta get out of here. No. I'm gonna get the hell out of Dodge. How much ammo do I even have for that, though? There should be something I have infinite ammo for. There should never be a situation where I just don't have any ammo for anything. That way. Yeah, that's right. I can flip the fuck around like that and not get sick. You jelly? You jellyfish? You peanut butt hurting jelly? You pristine Nidarian specimen? Of the order Turtopsis Nutricula. That's how jellyfish you are. Which is pretty fucking jellyfish. Speaking as a marine biologist. Uh, nope. Is this any good? Razor Impact Rifle. I like the sound of that. Yes! Dual railguns. That's what I'm talking about. Probably I could just let that open and save some ammo, but I've learned nothing from running out of ammunition just now. Wow, okay. Wow, that's almost one hit, one kill. It's basically two hits. I'm in love. Never thought I'd love again. Where you been all my life? Yeah, learning to heal has really upped my game. Which should go without saying. I just have to be very careful to shoot with precision. What is that? Did I drop that? Is that mine? Yeah, this is clearing out the room really quickly. I'm liking this a lot. I have to be precise, but I'm pretty good at that. It's not one of my weaknesses. Like, uh, for example, thick, meaty buttocks and thumping jungle rhythms. Which are good weaknesses to have. I would argue... What's a Razor Shredder? This one sucked. I'm getting rid of that. I have to get rid of shit in my inventory to pick up health? Are you fucking me? Fuck off. That's retarded. And not in the fun way where you can hire a bus full of Down Syndrome kids and... and Batman costumes and then it'll drive up to the door of somebody you know and when they they knock and he opens they just all rush in there before he gets a chance to process what's happening and they just start partying partying hard like only retards know how to just smashing the place and, and howling like like a like wild gibbons and then they all fucking like it's like a flash mob it's like a flash mob, but they, they get naked pretty quickly. It's not part of the package. Nobody tells them to. They just have, like, an instinct for it. And then grease each other up, and... and if you really want to fucking drive them wild, talk about Disney World. They fucking love Disney World. Disney World! Disney World! Or Nintendo 64. Who can blame them? Those are two of the greatest pleasures in life. Imagine Nintendo 64 at Disney World. Talk about living as few men dare dream. 
I, I think if I was playing Nintendo 64 at the Disneyland Resort Hotel with a bunch of greased up retards in a hotel room, I would feel as if my life had peaked. Maybe I can, uh, maybe I can make that happen with the money I'll, I'll bring in from my farting ASMR videos idea. Although it isn't really my idea, it's in the Bible. That's where I got the idea from originally. Okay, through there. This is a really good map. Reminds me of Metroid maps, kind of on, like on GBA. Or SNES, I guess for that matter. Why was there never an N64 Metroid? That's the weirdest shit. Apparently, I read they were planning it. And the DS Metroid looks at, shows that it could have looked good. Like the hardware was not the problem. Because you can do sci-fi environments with relatively low polygons and they look they look fine. Rectilinear sci-fi quarters do not suffer very badly for being low poly. What would you slow No! Whoa! Whoa there, buddy. I barely know you. That's my purse, I don't know you! If it was one shot, one kill, it would be perfect, but it can't be perfect. They can't have any, any single perfect weapon in the game. Would you not? Hey! I'm flying here! Now I'm flying over here! Now over here, a little bit, like about 10 yards from where I was a second ago. I'm, I'm flying here now. I'm gonna keep you posted about where I'm flying. No, no. No, no. Uh. Uh. It was like that tank from those parts of Star Fox nobody liked. Cruel Shredder. Oh, that's the shotgun. I, I never liked this one, I don't think. Or this one. A lot of the bullet weapons are kind of dog shit. Oh, good. Well, I may as well just leave all these fucking things here to die. Is this a good one or not? Is this... This is a good one. Berserker. Eh? That's gotta be better. Those have both got to be better. And that's the sign that I'm about to get my ass pounded. <laughs> oh, this really debilitates them. Those robot looking ones. You can stun them really badly so they don't shoot right away. I don't need to read lore right now, thank you. Or ever, really. What lore could there possibly be for a game about shooting polygon robots? It was the twelfth age of the polygon robot wars. Fighting over the, the polygons had intensified because of trade agreements between Triangle and Hexagon Nebulas. Why can't the people of the Polygon Galaxy realize that they are more similar than different, being that they're all comprised of equilateral sides? I don't know. I was never going to be able to keep that up for very long. Is this good? Rusty grenade. Fuck you! And fuck these dumb fire missiles, too. More like Mrs. Dumbfire. Wait, that's already what they're named. That's not how that works. That's not how any of this works. 
Performance is kind of taking a shit. Hold on. I don't know why. I think because I have... Am I encoding video in the background or not, am I? No, I'm not going to turn it down for one. Fuck it. Turn down for what? Turn down for what? Okay, there's a door there I haven't been through. This really is like Metroid. If somebody made a Descent Metroidvania instead of making it a roguelike, that would have, I think, been an even better idea. Cut that. What a marvelous shape, my lad. There we go. Yeah, there's a memory leak or something. I don't know what the deal is. If a force field comes up over this, thank goodness. Okay, wait a minute. Where did I come from? Where'd I go? Where did I come from? Cut and I, Joe. Nope. Nope. Okay, there's a door way the fuck back where I came from. Back to where we started from. Oh, would you carry me? Oh, would you carry me? Back to where we started from. No, you're actually really heavy. I won't. I'm sorry. I know it would be romantic, but man. Spine health is not a joke. As a man in my 30s, I really have to watch my lower back and not do anything too strenuous. So... You know, if you want a mobility scooter, I could recommend some excellent brands. Well, would you carry me? Would you, I already said no. Mobility scooters are one of those things where I have too much shame to ever ride one, but they look really fun. Like, if, if you souped them up, wouldn't you want to play... Um, Mario Kart IRL like in a Costco like a big box store after like everybody had left that's like on that's on my bucket list but I don't know how to fulfill it I have to take care of this fucker first where where are you wow that was effective all right I love these things I already have this. Do I have this? Marksman Firebolt. How could that possibly be any good? I'll give it a shot. No, no that's not it. Wow, that's even shittier. I didn't think anything could be. What is this? That's Razor Shredder or Cruel Shredder? They have the same amount of damage. One has a... One has higher ACC than the other. I have no... idea what that means. I guess it's good, though. Maybe. Fuck! I'm getting pounded from every direction. You jelly. It's okay. It's okay to be jelly. KY jelly. Oh, fuck. No, I've got no... Where, where's the health? Where's the health? Where's the health? Where's the health? Fuck off. Fuck off. There's somebody left. I feel sure of it. Yep. Would you... Would you... Hold the... No. Okay. Okay. I already have that. God damn it. Please have health. Yes, thank goodness. How did I even get as far as I did without any health before? That was stupid. Not the dumbest thing I've ever done. It's got some steep competition in that respect, but it's close. It's not like I wasn't trying. Is 
Is that a, what's a, a big X is a door I can't open yet? Is that the deal? I need the key or something? There's a door over there I haven't opened. VR just makes me dread that almost certainly the age of manned exploration is over. Because if we can send a robot someplace and the robot has two arms and two legs. And can physically do everything a human can do. And we can connect the human's eyes to the robot's cameras using a VR headset. And when the human turns its head, the robot turns its head and everything like that. And have complete haptic feedback for the robot's arms and everything. Then at that point, really, I misinterpreted the map. I'm going back. What's the point of sending a human? Like the robot gives you 100% of the benefits of having a human being there. You can't do it for very long distances. You couldn't, for example, teleoperate a humanoid robot on Mars because of the, the, the uh, delay. What you could do is have a space station in Mars orbit and have the robots be on the ground so stuff like storms would not endanger the crew and we would only need to build an ISS style space station that could withstand the g-forces of being sent from Earth orbit to Mars orbit. But that would, I mean, to go that close and then not actually send humans to the surface would be such blue balls, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? I mean... We could probably control a humanoid robot on the moon, potentially. I don't, I don't, I'm not 100% sure of that. The delay might still be too brutal. I don't see where to go. I've been this way, I've been that way. Oh, there's a door I haven't been through. go ahead and use up all my ammunition no good reason just for funsies just for funsies being a man means you don't need reasons for what you do cuz I'm a man woman don't always think before I do Uh oh what have I got myself into that's why you're supposed to think before you do. Ah! Got no missiles. Maybe if I fly through that cloud of, of goodies. Nope, still no missiles. Good thing this is so OP. I should really re-enable the, the railgun too. Railgun and shotgun would be an ideal combo, I think. Here we go. 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 I'm just a poor boy. Nobody loves me. He's just a poor boy from a poor family. I want a poor boy sandwich now. I had a marksman cannon, which I think was actually my railgun, but I misunderstood and got rid of it, which I'm now regretting. Is this it? No, it's the Razor Impact Rifle. I still have it. Oh, good. This is the this is the combo, dude. This is what you want: shotgun and railgun. I'm the main in fucking. Doom 4 as well. Although it's not really a railgun in Doom 4. They couldn't do that because they were going to release Quake Champions so soon after it. And they didn't want them... They wanted to differentiate them as much as possible. I don't think Quake Champions has glory kills. Does it? I haven't played it yet. I don't play much that's not in VR anymore. I got their attention. Which I really shouldn't have done without killing them. These are some of the slowest witted robots I've ever seen in the game. That's saying something. 
I mean, even compared to the AI, the body AI in uh, Daikatana. I'm sorry to dredge up those bad memories. I actually thought the level design in Daikatana was dope. Probably because that's the thing John Romero was actually good at. And game design is all, not all just level design, it turns out. Oh, this one. Okay. I never needed that. I never will. I don't need that either. What's this? Riot laser. No, that's just the worst version of the rapid laser, I believe. Let's see, rate. Low damage. This is better in every way, except for ACC, whatever ACC is. Animal Crossing uh, Compton Edition? I don't know. That'd be pretty awesome. Like San Andreas, but with animals. I didn't understand Grand Theft Auto San Andreas when I first saw it. I, I didn't realize it was a Grand Theft Auto game. I thought it was just the black version of The Sims. Um, do I have to shoot doors to open them? Or... No, I don't. I'm retarded. I've been wasting ammo the entire version first half of the game well live and learn although perhaps I won't complete the live part of that shortly oops Pew. 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 there's too many number of robots is too damn high it's too damn high That thing I said before two seconds ago, I'll say again. It's too damn high. Because repetition is the essence of humor, you see. Oh, they're seekers. That's why they're fucking me so badly. Oh, more health. Yes. Yes. Right when I needed it. This is how gravity works. This is how lava works. How dare you question me. Oh, shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, I was so close. Oh, fuck. I don't want to do that again. I think this is enough. I think this series has had a good run. I figured out how to pl play it properly. And I reached the limits of my skills pretty quickly, like I did in life. Um... You know, where you just, you think you're the smartest fucking smartass in the world just because you don't have to try in elementary or middle school. And then you coast along paying attention to nothing and just acing all the tests anyway until BAM! You hit a wall right about in the freshman year of college and you're fucking, you're a babe in the woods without any clue as to what to do because you've painted yourself into a corner and you're like, well shit, I'm not going to be able to succeed until unless you know something some crazy shit happens like somebody invents bullshit internet money where i can get rich just uh recording myself playing video games and writing about stuff but <laughs> what are the odds of that happening